So, what comes inside of a Wilds of Eldraine bundle? Let's open this up and find out. All right, looks like we have the oversized spin down counter there. Ooh, that looks really cool. You got that purple kind of translucent with the Wilds of Eldraine icon on the top. That's pretty. In this first white package here, we've got a few guaranteed cards. All right, so we have the basic lands from the set. These are non-foil. Also an interesting card in the end, how to cast spells. I don't know that I've seen this one before. Also talks about attacking and blocking. Yeah, I don't think that I've seen a card like this previously. Here we have another package of guaranteed cards that should be in every bundle. And we have a foil copy of Lich Knight's Conquest. And now we have foil basic lands. These all look really cool. I love the basic lands, especially like the purples and the greens. For some reason, those colors really seem to pop on these. And we have, count them, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight set boosters from Wilds of Eldraine. Here's pack number one. All right, first we have, ooh, look at that art card. It's one of the anime full arts. Plains Foil. Hopeful Vigil. Hopeless Nightmare. Wicked Visitor. Warehouse Tabby. Disdainful Stroke. Archive Dragon. Up the Beanstalk. Troyan, Gutsy Explorer. Ooh, Yenna, Red Tooth Regent. I think that's the first one of these I've opened. Dark Tutelage. Ashiox Reaper. And a Strictly Better card. <laughs> it's Strictly Better! And now we have pack number two. And now it's time for pack number two.
starting off with oh i can't remember the name of these uh they're like liquid teacher wizard teachers or something like that all right we have a regular mountain so it's not guaranteed foil quick study water wings frantic firebolt unruly catapult living lectern hearth elemental johan apprentice sorcerer splashy spell that's what they're called splashy spellcasters <laughs> uh restless vine stock i'm not sure what I, how i feel about these new lands uh oh, <laughs> oh yeah ristic study baby ah oh, amazing and troublemaker oof in foil oh and a bird token yay bird token and now we have a pack number three all right starting off with oh that's not the witch's cauldron it's one of the other cards but i can't remember the name of it um all right we've got oh does it say the name on the back oh it does say the name, it says the name on the back it is waste not okay got it uh planes minecart daredevil verdant outrider fell horseman tempest heart collector's vault frocking familiar excuse me frolicking familiar hearth elemental court of embreth monarch card the end eh, see this card too much i don't like it that much fraying sanity eh, again uh, not so great collector's vault in foil all right you know not a fantastic pack unfortunately Pack number f and pack number four. Here we go. Ooh, that's a cool. I actually don't know the name of that one. Let me see. The name is that uh, Court of Ventress. All right. Forest full art. I'm calling these, by the way, the Samurai Jack lands. I don't care what anybody else says. That's what it looks like to me. Samurai Jack. Gnawing Crescendo, Harried Spear Guard, Rat Out, Voracious Vermin, Edgewall Pack, more rat cards, uh, Ashiox Reaper, Eerie Interference, Glass Casket, Mosswood Dread Knight, I love this card, uh, Griffin Airy. And Grand Ball Guest Foil. And a rat token. Pack number five. And here we go. Starting off with, ooh. I love the art cards that are horizontal like this. I usually use them to mark my command zone. Uh, this is Gnawing Crescendo. Nice. That'll be great for the rat deck. We have a Swamp. Territorial Witch Stalker. Leaping Ambush. Hollow Scavenger. Commune with Nature. Disdainful Stroke. Archive Dragon, Up the Beanstalk, Horned Lock Whale. I've gotten a lot of these. These boxes seem to love giving me these whales. The End. Oh, come on. Another one of the end? I didn't want to see another one of those in here. Garruk's Uprising. That's fine. I'll always take another copy of this. And Stormkeld Prowler. And pack number six. All 
All right. So, ooh, there's that uh, moss. There's that Mosswood Dread Knight. That's some, that art really pops. I like that one a lot. All right, we've got Forest, Edgewall Pack, Rat Catcher Trainee, Armory Mice, Flick a Coin, Fairy Dream Thief. Yes, I needed more of these. Neva Stalked by Nightmares. Ariette's Tempting Apple. Ooh, love to see that one in foil. Stone Splitter Bolt. Mosswood Dread Knight. Two Mosswood Dread Knights in the pack. Look, see? Eh? Fiery Emancipation. Yeah. I'll take that triple damage. Thank you very much. And, ooh, a Polluted Bonds Foil. Pack number seven. All right, starting off. Oh, Beast Token. Hey, you know what? This is even better than the Beast Token is the full art. All right, we got Planes. Feed the Cauldron. Scream Puff. Always laugh when I see these. Yes, Minstrosity. I love these food ones. Candy Grapple. Okay, come on. Someone's playing a trick on me now, right? You're getting all the food ones in a row? Like, come on. That's That, that can't be an accident. Uh, Archive Dragon. Up the Beanstalk. Troyan, Gutsy Explorer. Tempest Heart. I like that one. Talion. There we go. Nice. Dragon Mantle. I like that one. Draws you a card. It's a cantrip. And Johan's Stopgap. Pretty good looking foil there. And a food token. All right, last one. Here we go. I mean, I'm already good with the Ristic study, so at this point, everything else is just gravy. Okay, flipping over for... Oh, I don't remember which card this is. It is... Throne of Eldraine. Well, there we go. All right, Full Art Island, Samurai Jack. Barrow Naughty. Nice. Cooped up. Sleight of Hand. Troyan Gutsy Explorer. Tempest Heart. Collector's Vault. Experimental Confectioner. More food fun. Gumdrop Poisoner. Utopia Sprawl. That new art is amazing. Spreading Seas. And finally, a foil of Splashy Spellcasters. Oh, sorry. We have a card from the list. Uh, Exelon's Binding. All right. Not a particularly great commander card, but, uh, you know, I'll take it. All cards from the list are cool. So personally, I'm going to say this Ristic Study is probably the winner, but you let me know. What were some of the other cards you liked that we pulled out of the box?